one thing that when we talk about microbiological warfare and all these things, right? When we talk about what is going on in the world and we are all being manipulated and there's a lot of things going on, we come to the big thing about CO2. Because the CO2, the Kyber, yep. um, that's probably the biggest bomb, <coughs> or more, one of the biggest bombs. Yeah. What have you got to say about microwaves and emissions and, and CO2? Um, a couple of years ago, uh, there are three papers published <coughs> about this. I think I've referenced one or two of them because they all really come up with the same. <clears throat> and what they now say is the, the biggest polluter on the planet now by far is the communications industry. The biggest polluter. It exceeded the aviation industry a few years ago. So, in other words, all of the exhaust fumes from all of the aeroplanes in the world is now exceeded by the carbon dioxide produced by the communications industry. And it's produced because you have hundreds and hundreds of thousands of transmitters all over the world. They all need power. <clears throat> All the mobile phones need power. All the Wi-Fi sets need power. All the gadgets need power. And all this power has to be generated to feed the industry. And the more the industry put out Wi-Fi, not only are they contributing to warming the atmosphere, but they are increasing this carbon footprint, as it's called. Uh, so, the mobile industry is the greatest polluter on the planet today. The greatest polluter. Uh, and that is documented. <clears throat> and the funny thing is, with this government, and I think our governments are still corrupt, uh, this government was talking just a few months ago, <clears throat> and it was coming over the BBC saying that motorists Will, will be charged another seven or eight pence a litre for petrol to cut down the motoring and to help pay for all of the carbon going into the atmosphere. And yet you hear nothing, absolutely nothing, anywhere in the world against the mobile industry in terms of pollution. No one talks about it. No one ever reflects. They are the people are scared. They are the biggest polluters in the world. They are now responsible for more animal suffering and death in the world. They are responsible for the catastrophic event, events in nature, like trees dying, uh, the pollinators not pollinating plants. <clears throat> They are devastating the natural nature of this planet. And that is written. And it's also published that the total cost of devastating this environment, these ecosystems, I think it's something like $33 trillion a year or something it could cost uh, when all the damage is fully done. But this one industry, I think, is going to cause more damage to this planet than anybody has ever managed to do in any war or by any global destructive mechanism. This industry is doing it uh, without opposition. And it's, it's going to cause all of this. Uh, and the evidence is n not just from me, uh, as a government person who was trained in this. Um, it, it's from veterinary surgeries, scientists, environmental scientists. It, it's coming in from everywhere that this industry is responsible.